planning on taking the MCAT this summer, then you should study with me. For those of you that don't know who I am, my name is John. I am a soon to be fourth year medical student. I'm a 90th percentile MCAT score. And before I went back to medical school, I spent a couple of years tutoring for some of the big box companies and most recently started this YouTube channel and subsequently this business with my sister Maggie. At this point, we've been really, really lucky and blessed to tutor, you know, well over a thousand of you students and, and impact your scores. And I would love to have an even bigger impact this summer by having you study with me. Now, what does that mean? I'm sorry, but I'm not gonna be tutoring you individually. I'm not even gonna be tutoring you as a group. Actually, I'm going to be studying this summer myself. See, this summer, I take step two, which if you're not familiar with the standardized exams of medical school, you take step one at the end of your preclinical years, which is your first two years of medicine. And then at the end of your third year, you take step two. And step one's pass fail. Step two though, that's the one that counts. And if you're trying to do a competitive specialty, like I am unfortunately attracted to doing a competitive surgical specialty, then you gotta blow that test out of the water. From all the information I've gathered, it's very similar to medical school or getting in, meaning that you know your research and your extracurriculars and even your GPA is great, but just like with medical school, the not so secret secret is that the MCAT is the biggest determining factor of whether or not you get into medical school. Your step two score is going to be very, very similar in that aspect. And so I've spent the entirety of this year, whenever I'm not at the hospital, studying in small chunks, but it's very difficult to get any meaningful studying in. Uh, you have to be at the hospital at like 5 a.m. and you know, some days you get out at two and some days you get out at seven. And that's not every rotation, but it's a lot of them. So this summer, whenever I finish my final third year clerkship rotation on May the 23rd, I believe, I will be full-time step studying. I'm a really big believer that whatever you put into your studies is what you're gonna get out of it. And I'm going to do my best to prove that to you all with this exam. And I want you to study with me. How exactly that's gonna look, it's kind of why I'm making this video. So you let me know, what would be the best way for us to study together and motivate each other and encourage each other and hold each other accountable. Do you want me to like live stream some of my studies? Um, should we have like a specific discord uh, wherever we keep each other accountable? I don't know, whatever ideas you have, or maybe even we have a community through the IFD website where we work on this together. I'm not sure, but if you're looking for an accountability partner, you're looking for somebody that's gonna wake up early and is going to work themselves into the dirt all day and you need that you need that partner he's looking at you i am going to smush this test and you're going to do the same with the mcat and i am just as scared as you are right now i'm very intimidated i've done all this work and this test could really determine whether or not i get to do one of the few things i've actually found enjoyable at the hospital so yeah i'm scared and i'm going to have to do really well i'm going to have to work really really hard but I've been very fortunate in that the MCAT was a struggle for me. And so I figured out that to do well on these exams, you're just focusing on a few different things. And so I'm going to take the exact same approach for step two that I have you all taking in the UWorldX High FD High Yield course, where I'm essentially focusing on the high yield concepts. I'm going to know every single one of those. I'm going to know a good amount of the low yield concepts and I'm going to just work practice questions until I can't breathe. So if you want to do that with me, if you want an accountability partner, and if you have a good idea for how we should do that, leave a comment below. Let us know how we can best pull this off. I really have no clue, but I do think it would be beneficial for you all. If you're studying to test this summer, let's do it together. Thanks for watching the video and I'll see you in the next one.